Good, you being famous. Whatever going to play here, new, not new game. Uh, part two of Contract Me One. So we're going to continue. Okay, so here we are. Okay. So without further ado, let's try and start. Uh, are you sure there haven't, there haven't been any summon attempts in the past week? Just like I said yesterday. Oh. Ooh, some tick demon over here. Very nice. Some very, very tick demon here. Mazo. Uh, just like I said yesterday, he rich must be busy with something. Uh, this is weird. Yeah, it is weird. Did something scare her up? No. I mean, I don't think so. You seem kind of frantic, Cammy. Is worried, isn't it? Someone summoned you three days in a row and then nothing for two weeks? What did they do wrong? You're the sentimental side, aren't you? Oh, excuse me. I'm not sentimental. I'm a demon. Want me to hook you up with a new summoner? I don't know. Be sentimental. You don't want to give up the one you had. This is not it. Uh, ask me again tomorrow. I'm clocking out. <laughs> I'm not sentimental. She little wanted to keep summoning me. That's what she was saying. Oh, it's weird that she isn't. There's nothing more to it. It's just something weird that's happening and I want to know why. That's all it is. Why does everyone think it's because I got attached to her or something? It's so... It's all so stupid. <laughs> Meanwhile, I want to see Eleni. Yeah, so it's Eleni and Camilla. Okay, so yeah, I can't believe they find me out. Can go back there now. Oh, they buried my, my ritual gear. There's nowhere else I could have left it. Oh, do you want to see Oh, I want to see Camilla again. Oh, is this love? Love between an angel and a demon? Even if it's what I hope for, I didn't seriously expect it. But how can I summon her again? I have to get a new plute. And the rug too does look a lot of effort to make right. <laughs> Unless... <laughs> That's crazy enough to work, and if it does work, it must be soulmates. <laughs> oh no, I really like the sound of that. Wow, I never thought it would have I would have a real crush. Wait for me, Camilla. We'll reunite for sure. Reunited. Two more weeks pass. Oh, if you want to be success successful as a contract demon, you'll need to be able to find common ground with each new client. Sometimes in summer we ask for something truly unreasonable, but that's not where you should be shying away. Rather it's a point of attack. If we can at least meet them halfway, then both parties will come out to feel satisfied. Camilla, are you paying attention? Yeah. At least try a little harder to get your next contract settled. It's a waste of everyone's time when negotiations are just dropped. Oh, there was nothing to negotiate with the last thing one. It was just another sex thing. Why are humans so obsessed with getting pocked by demons? Language, Camilla. Whatever, everyone who summons demons is an idiot. Look, I know you've been feeling a little depressed after your first client disappeared, but isn't it time to move forward? I still think it's weird. And I'm not depressed about it. Stop saying that every time you happen to look sad. Sorry, but clearly it's still bothering you and affecting your work ethic, which is why I have to bring it up as a supervisor. Uh. Do you want to talk about to talk about it? Maybe some other time. Sorry, I'll try to focus and work. All right, I'm here to listen whenever you're ready. Um, an entire month later. Oh, is this the demon town? <laughs> some demon. Those were angels' wings, right? Was it cosplay? Dude, there was a real angel in the pure world. Wouldn't we have to duke it out like a steam aren't we supposed to? Angel wings. Oh my god! Yes. Oh my god, Eleni came to the fucking netherworld. Totally shit. Uh, Camilla, I finally found you! Oh, why are you here? 
Why are you here? Okay, it's a long story. We got kicked out of where I was living, and then I lost some of my summoning gear. <laughs> a real tragedy, I know, so I couldn't summon you at all, and then I thought... Why don't I just go to the river world and find her? So I find my I mean my way here. And now we finally reunited. You you find me the netherworld as if that's so easy to do. The netherworld is huge. I know. Do you have any idea how lucky you are that we just happened to cross paths today? Hey, it brought us back together. Hey, <laughs> <I> Unmi. <eat Unme. laughs> I've actually gone to a lot of different things when Siri is looking for you, you know. You have to go home. What? After all this? Take me to your place. Ha, 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 um, that would be really a bad idea. Hey, are you a real angel? Yeah, hey there. Probably stop, you'll draw a crowd. Oh, uh, what are you going to do in the nether world? Aren't you gonna get killed? Uh, it's fine, but everything is fine. Okay, okay, come to my place. Let's go, let's go. Hooray! Holy oh, shit, dude. Holy shit. <laughs> Lenny just got some fucking dirty shit to Camilla. <laughs> I mean, Camilla's room. We're lucky my brother isn't here. Um, what did you bring with you? Do you happen to have your robe in that bag? Yeah, yeah, I brought it. Why? Because your brother can know who you are. If you want to stay here for a bit, you need to pretend to be a demon. Oh, I see. So you get to dress me up like a demon, but you don't get to dress you like a bunny. Well, well never mind that. Put on the robe, and then uh, we need to do something about your skin tone. Oh. Sh shit, he's here. The robe should be enough. Just keep your hood low, okay? Okay. <laughs> oh, so it's oh, look. To the brothers. Hey Camilla, for dinner I was thinking. Oh, I didn't realize you had someone over. Uh, oh, look, this is my friend. We met on the nerder room. If you are shy around men, so please make yourselves scarce. I'm sorry, I invited her without any notice. Mm. <laughs> Alright, sorry to intrude. I'll knock when dinner is ready. You really does look like you, and it's taller, like you said. It was a pretty good lie about me. Hmm. One that only worked if he's polite. A polite demon. What's the cash? I wonder. Uh, Camilla? This is so stressful. What's stressful? I'm having fun. Uh, Lani. I've just been going with the plum, but why do I have to pretend to be a demon again? Because I wasn't supposed to be make friends with clients. But our very first contract with your friends. I know I messed up. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm really causing a lot of trouble for you by coming here, huh? It's not your fault. You shouldn't just not see you again. I'm sorry I didn't summon you like normal. I should have tried harder to get the stuff right again. If I thought about something, if somehow finding yourself, you myself, I'd be really excited and have my heart set on doing that. Ah, uh, it's not just like you. Camilla, I've had a lot of time to think while I'm searching for you. I love demons, but I can't be satisfied becoming friends with just any demon. It has to be you. Oh. And for corrupting my heart like that, you must be punished. Ooh. You're punishing me? Oh, so fucking you is shit right now, haven't you? Well, you were punished enough by me showing up and causing trouble. So now we're even. <laughs> You're so outrageous. Did you miss me, Camilla? I... I don't know. Maybe it was fixating on you out of kill, but I actually had a lot of fun whenever you summoned me. Did you know? Because you made a contract with a demon. Your soul belongs to the netherworld? That's the most romantic thing you ever said to me, Camilla. <laughs> I'm being serious. I I'm being serious. Each contract takes a bit of your soul as demon, and when you die, you'll be reborn as a demon. Become a demon? It just keeps getting better. No, 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 you don't understand. It won't be you anymore. You don't get to keep any of your memories when you're reborn. Oh. I thought I could do this job. I thought I could be the big scary demon, taking souls in exchange for babies. 
But the number one to do you a paper again if it means I'm creep keeping away at your life. It's fuck up. I don't mind. Lenny. I don't think you betrayed me. I do regret summoning you. So I guess it's good that I came here after all. I won't summon you anywhere. We can just get together like normal friends. Okay, yeah. You're not my client. Then we can be friends. Or girlfriends. Um. Looks like dinner is ready. Thanks for luck. I'm just saying, come on, take them out of the cave. <laughs> they trade that night. So that's everything that happened. Sorry, couldn't talk about it before. I understand why it would be hard to talk with me about all that. You can also imagine you wanted the problem to conveniently paint away without having to tell me your mistake. I was lucky it might until she showed up today. Right, so here we are. Hey Ulug, is there a way to cancel a contract? Hmm. I never should have made it. I shouldn't have agreed. I was just going with the flow. As being her friend friend upside if someone is still causes me doing her a favor, does it keep taking bits of her soul? What a this contract? Why did I settle on something so big? Thinking I'd be kind. I'm an idiot. Well, if the contract is inter interpreted as the act of starting the friendship rather than the act of maintaining the friendship, then you could just amend the original contract to have a clear language. Both parties can sign and you'd be free. A demon freeing herself from her own contract? <laughs> Typically, it's the clients trying to free themselves from some of the more nasty contracts. Yep, and I managed to turn it around. That's how bad a failure I am with a contract demon. Are you, are you going to quit? Oh, as your oldest? Absolutely. Thanks for having me, but it is my two weeks' notice. Fair enough. Let me sit around the office, but it's for the best. So, we can really just amend the contract and the friendship thing isn't a concern anymore? Yep. Just clarify the intention, and there's no risk of more of her soul being taken. Oh, good, good. So, when are you going to probably introduce me to this girl? Is she really afraid of men? <laughs> no, no. She's a demon fanatic, so she just asks you a thousand strange questions. You should be afraid of her. Know that. I'll have to clear up my schedule a bit if she really has so many questions for me. Alright, I'm going back inside. Thanks for the talk. I'm dinner. It was really good, as always. Sure thing. Uh, don't stay up too late. Night, Ulog. Mm, that's cute. That's cute. Okay, back to... Ellie? Hey, sorry to keep you. Are you going through my things? I was just looking, Lenny. You have more games and comics than expected. Is that where you get your inspiration for being to know like? Never mind that, so about our first contract. It looks as we can amend it so that it's already explicitly fulfilled. But wait, there's no risk of me hurting you by being a friend. Oh, you were worried about that? I already told you. Whatever the price I have to be pay I have to pay to be with you, it's worth it. Don't say that. It's like throwing your life away. I don't want you to do that. Then is it impossible? You return my feelings? Just because I don't want you to die, that's quite a stretch. Okay, we can amend the contract. Good, good. Yeah, everything's in order. All of our contracts together have been fulfilled. So you don't have to give up any of your soul. Now, you're free to be friends. Or girlfriends. <laughs> as well as all we can be friends, okay? Okay, now what? Now, um, well, it's pretty late, you may as well stay the night. Hey, last time you had a sleepover with me, and now I get to have one with you. Yep, that's how it turned out. Your bed isn't as- your bed is, isn't as big as mine was. We'll have to cuddle pretty close. Uh, I'll sleep on the floor. Oh, uh, even so, you slept in the same bed before? For being so shy? It's over now, and don't say it like that. Okay. Do you um, need to borrow pajamas or anything? No, these are my pajamas. Do you own any normal clothes? Of course I do. Of course I do. They're just not as comfy. 
<laughs> You're so strange. Well, what do your pajamas look like? And we see you strange. What are you even expecting? Fine, I'll show you. Uh, actually, I'll change in the bathroom. Why? It's embarrassing. You're so shy. <laughs> oh, nice. See, normal. You lose the not strange contest. I'll happily lose it if I get to see you look this cute. <laughs> you can't even lose normally, you weirdo. It's more fun to be strange anyway. Hey, Camilla, is it hard to sleep when you're sad because of your horns? Uh huh, not really. I guess now that I think of it, I usually sleep more on my stomach. What? Do your horns ever hit the bar of your bed frame? Is that why your pillow is placed down lower? Oh, have you ever impaled your walls in accidents? <laughs> have such big horns seem so dangerous? Oh, true. But are you going to ask me really specific questions all night? Oh no, I forgot it makes you mad. <laughs> you don't have to answer. Anyway, are you tired? Should we do anything before bed? I want to read one of your books. Oh, okay. I mean something we can both do together, but that's fine too. Don't worry. It's only something we can do together. And it's the kind of book we wanted to ask for this. Hmm? Adult comics. I don't have any. Not that I'm willing to share. Anyway, I have to keep my secrets safe. I hope you'll share with me one day. You know, comments like that just wouldn't satisfy me anymore. Not since you corrupted my heart. Your heart was bloody corrupt from the beginning. Do you have any demon anatomy books? Maybe that will be enough. See you crap as hell. I'll be your dark angel, Camilla. You're so embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for letting me stay over. You can go to sleep now if you want. Alright, I'll set up my sleeping bag. Mm -hmm. Oh, I just thought it's the end. Uh, Camilla? I'm happy that I give up on looking for you. It was really worth it. Is it okay if I hold your hand for a while? You have hands under those sleeves? Hmm, what if they were pattery bird hands? Would you be surprised? Let's see. Mm, it feels normal. How disappointing. Hey, <laughs> normal. Really? Well, I guess they're pretty small to me, but I'm more used to demon hands. Uh, uh, Eleni? Sorry, just wanted to take in the moment a little. Oh, uh, thanks, Camilla. Aw, cute. Cute, cute, cute. I'm being too nice, probably. You get carried away because she said like you back. That's all this is. Holding her hand was pretty incriminating, though. That could easily be mistaken for something romantic. Uh, not only am I appealed as a contra demon, but as a demon in general. What kind of demon gets into a relationship like this? I can't even make sense of these feelings. Is it because I can actually started to like her? No, 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 <laughs> no, 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 no. This can go on. I have to get some of my self-respect back. It's a demon. I have to be mean. The next day? The next day it is. Now we're outside and we have the evil, evil angel, the bullying angel, Alain. You made me wear the rope again? I think you like seeing me in after all. No, no, I just don't want you to draw attention like yesterday. You can't parade around the underworld as an angel, it's dangerous. I've been parading around as an angel the whole time I was looking for you. Yeah, I really don't know how you managed that. Maybe it was my angelic luck? But seriously, what makes- oh. oh! Oh, can I back? Wait a minute, back. What makes it so dangerous? Well, angels represent everything a demon should hate. Someone might try to start a fight. Do you hate and angels, Camilla? No comment. What? No fear, you have to answer. 
Excuse me. I don't have a strong opinion either way. You're the only angel I've met. <laughs> By the way, where are you taking me? To the station. I'm sending you home. What? I don't want to go home. We just reunited. Right, now you know where I live so you can come back whenever you want. What's the problem? You're so cold, even though the we held hands for so long last night. I won't say that so loud, or the will get the wrong idea. Well, we did. You can just send me away after that. If I didn't mention before, I don't have a home to go back to at the moment. Oh, where have you been staying until now then? I've been living the life of a vagabond. Right, right. Well, I quit my job yesterday, so I kinda need to look for a new one. Can't hang out with you today. Then I'll wait at your place. I'll be good. You can stay with us. You saw how small our apartment is. Ulug doesn't even get his own room. That's fine. I'll just become your neighbor instead. Take me to your landlord. This is dumb for harassment, isn't it? I'm so sorry. I just don't want you to far away from you because of... Oh, the pain in my heart! Quit messing around. I'm not messing around, I really like you, which is a new feeling for me. Oh, I guess no one's ever liked me that much before. Oh, wait, stop, stop, we're not doing this. Demons don't do romance. That's okay, I don't expect anything from you. I just wanted to be honest about my feelings. At the very least, I won't lie to you about that. I'll find a place to stay so that I'm not bothering you and your brother. So it's still okay if we meet up again tomorrow. Um, yeah, yeah, okay. Hehe, <laughs> okay, bye for now, Kamala. <laughs> That's cute. Uh, I'm an idiot. I'm trying to push her away even though she likes me so much. Even though I like uh, being around her too. Oh, Moran, dumbass, what am I doing? But it's not like I can just be her girlfriend either. It's too undemon like. Wait, when did I start caring so much about what's right for a demon to do? To give a good impression of the netherworld, I started thinking that way from my job, which I just quit. Which means it will be okay after all. This is stupid. I need some outside input. I'll text Olog. Uh, do demons do romance? Lol. Damn it, we should have asked in person. I might as well drop by the office then. Guess we're back here. Uh, where's your brother? Up ceiling in a contract, duh. Damn it, I needed to talk to him. Why? What's up, Cammy? You know what? Yeah, it would actually be better to talk to you. I can always rely on my brother for everything. Oh, how mature. I mean, you've been seeing a few other women as far as I know, so maybe you can help me. Oh, like, you need help getting laid? Yeah, don't talk to your brother about that. <laughs> Isn't he asexual anyway? <laughs> yes, no, it's not a sex thing. It would have been so complicated if it was. Oh, then, what's the deal? It's a romantic thing. Oh, who oh, is it the witch you were obsessed with? Oh, that's so cute. Oh, obsessed is a bit of an under overstatement. I, I think so. It's so cute that a demon will love someone enough to be in that kind of relationship. Most demons just aren't that way, you know. Um, right? Demons don't fall in love normally. Demons don't do such crazy things like holding hands. You held her hand? It's more serious than I thought. It just feel like the right thing to do in the moment. Oh, sorry. Why are you apologizing? I don't know. Oh, well, I've never been in a romantic relationship, so I can offer advice there. If you need advice for the bedroom, no, get me up. Sure. Oh, hold on. Oh, she's sick at me. Okay. You should do what makes you happy. Don't worry so much about giving your feelings any who doesn't fit well with you yet. Time with me, or it may not. Either way is valid. Good luck, sis. We got, we got a better answer from him, didn't you? <laughs> Thanks for your help anyway. I'll be seeing her again tomorrow. 
Oh, so soon. You'd better tell me how it goes. Oh, well, oh. By the way, I quit yesterday. What? No, Miss Car? Dunny, and so. Oh. Oh! Here it is! My new apartment! And your items are back to normal? <laughs> what the hell? My new apartment! As of today, I am officially a resident of the Lunar World! You really moved in overnight. I'm starting to think your love is real. <laughs> the landlord ended up liking me a lot, so everything went really smoothly. Seriously, though, this is our can. It looks exactly like your old place in here. True, 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 true. Yeah, is it magic so convenient? Oh, you're just gonna go boop and voila. It just got up here, appear, disappear. Talking and packing is so easy, even though I ended up losing some things. Oh, that's right, Camilla. I have some t something very important to tell you. What is it? After yesterday, I did a lot of thinking. <sighs> okay, I get the feeling that you like me at least a little bit, but maybe I haven't opened up enough yet for you to like me all the way. So it conflict with my goals to hide things from now on, which means I have to confess. Uh, okay. I've actually been a witch this whole time. Oh. Calling myself an angel and pretending like I live in an angel town was all just part of my roleplay. My ways aren't real either. I'm sorry for lying to you. I hope you don't hate me. I already knew. Um, what? Yeah, when a contract demon is summoned, the identity of the summoner shows up in the system. I know from the start. But we didn't use the anything if you knew I was lying about being an angel. Because what would be the point of trying to call you on it? I mean, I've been wondering a reason, sure, but in the end I just chalk it up to you being a weirdo. <laughs> no, I have very legitimate reasons for pretending to be an angel. That's hard, it then. I like being an angel because a witch and a demon couple just isn't as exciting to me. <laughs> but this has been more some kind of romantic pursuit from the very beginning. No, it was supposed to be a sexual pursuit. It just happened to turn romantic before we even got to that point. <laughs> I take it back. You might be really unlucky after all. Why? Because you're still gonna reject me? No, 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 no. It's not that. You're unlucky because I think most other contract demons would have been down to pop. Camilla, you can see Brock in Angel's house! <laughs> you said it too. Camilla? Aww. <laughs> hey, you can just stack me into a bread every time you want to punish me. I'm the host right now. I can do whatever I want. Last time I was at my house. I suggest I can do whatever I want too. The bottom line is, I can do whatever I want and you just have to deal with it. Like this. Alright, alright. <laughs> I'm so happy. I get to cuddle with Camilla. I'll allow it for today. Oh, that's cute. Um, hey, Lenny, I actually have something I wanted to say to you. Okay, but if you're gonna tell me you were just role-playing a demon alone, I don't want to hear it. Uh, it's not that. I'm sorry about yesterday. When you show up again after so long, I had a lot of confusing feelings to sort out. Uh, it took me a while to accept how I feel about you, which I still don't know what to call exactly. Maybe it's something close to a romantic feeling? Even though that's weird for a demon to have. So yes, I'm a pig demon after all. <laughs> a pig demon and a pig angel couple. That's a pretty good demand for mice. Okay, I'll accept you as my girlfriend. That's what I was trying to say to you. <laughs> so real quick, real quick. I didn't think I'd reach my goal so fast. Now I have to move on to the next one. Uh -huh. And what could that possibly be? I have lots of embarrassing ones that I can say out loud and be surprised for. Hehe, <laughs> my girlfriend. I already regret this. Wanna know one of the goals? I can actually tell you. Sure. Become the next overlord and then I'll make you my secretary. Ah, uh, well, I didn't need a new job. Then it's decided we'll take over the netherworld together. We'll take over the netherworld together. You're such a dangerous angel. <laughs> hey. Hey, nice. Is that it? Hey. Very nice. Neat story. Very cute. Kawaii desu ne. 
an angel, a pink angel, and a pink demon, 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 I don't know, are all together. Very nice. Aww. Is that it? Yep. You can support this special things and you. Mm, thanks. Thank you. Thank you for reading. And that's gonna be it now. That's gonna be it. So, alright guys, if you enjoyed the story, please enjoy, consider leaving a tail yeah, no problems at all, extra pictures, one is gallery unlock. Oh! Is there something? Oh, original design is 2014, oh! So it's way far, I don't know where this came, wait a minute. Oh, bedroom, oh, is this like the, what you call those, the concept of the game? So this is like the cute room over here, uh, this one's... Lenny, Lenny concept stuff, also 2014. And the first contract by Nom Nom Nami, original comic available for free chest 10 pages, very nice. Oh, and this price as well from 2018. Early 2015. Coming in Lonely World Trade series. Hey, cute. Nice. Uh, that's neat, actually. So yeah, I'm gonna go end this one now, gamers. Very nice, actually. Kind of cute game. Oh, what is this? What the hell is this one? Okay. Well, it's screenshot on. Uh, I guess I'm gonna do that. So yeah, I guess I'm gonna go end this one of gamers. Like, subscribe, all of those shits, comment, notification bell, thank you guys for watching, and see you guys next time. Johnny, 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 Johnny.